skim milk Riz or something. Poke it with some. Ooh, yuck. It's like blubber. So I gotta move the fat hens today, but I'm gonna get some poultry nets because they're big enough to go out of the shocker knots. I've gotten Henry out to the fat hens. My golly. They're going from here to here. So I gotta set the net up. I have set up the new fence. Now I'm gonna move the chickens in. Done with it. Set up the electric fence to it. It's time to go move the turkeys now. They're just going from here to here. Finished the turkeys. Now I'm gonna go in and see how Papa's doing. You are getting cholesterol checkup, but mainly inflammation. Bye, buddy. Bye. We'll see you. You wanna give a hug? It's not like we're going away real far. Maybe be gone a couple of hours, three hours max. We'll be back soon. See you in three hours. See you in three hours. Bye bye. Tell him Teddy back. Because Teddy, Teddy would die following you. Yes, he would. He would just wear himself out. He's still ready after us. He's still going fast. He's, Teddy, he's still ready. <laughs> oh my word. Becky. Oh, Teddy, go home. Go home. You're going to get eaten. He's going to get eaten, Justin. He's still What's going to eat so him? Fast. Coyote. Uh, I'm on a cane today. That's better than a walker. It's amazing how. Yeah. My knee's not better, but it feels so much better. I haven't taken any, I didn't take any pain medicine last night. No. Or today, was able to sleep. You think that one pill I took the night before last is still working? No. Well then that means I'm getting better. That well, means the crappy lettuce is what I like to call it. <laughs> crap the lettuce. Right, crap, I don't know what it is. It's an uh, herb for arthritis. It tastes like crappy lettuce. Like rotten, juicy. It tastes like I'm drinking rotten lettuce juice. Sorry. Hey, but it's working. It's helping. That and everything else I'm doing. Broth. Uh, I did take in turkey soup this morning. That the turkey had been boiled for a while. Lots of turkey broth. Because I'm about to go do ozone injection in my. Well, I don't know where. Well. Pick a joint, lady. Well, we're gonna talk to the doctor about it all. Yeah. And we're gonna find out if we're gonna do prolozone, which is ozone, or prolotherapy, which is not ozone, but it's a healing. Oh. Um, it has, it's got some stuff in it that's healing. So I don't know, I don't know what we're gonna do. We're gonna find out. This is on an attempt to um, avoid steroids. We watched Seabiscuit <laughs> over the weekend. Yeah. And. I wonder where this is going. The horse. You know, it hurt its oh. ligament or whatever, and the vet said, "I'll put it. I'll put the horse down if That's you want me to." Right. And they brought it home and they rehabbed him, and he ran. He ran and won again. So I'm not saying that we're gonna put you down. And with that, she's like, or anything, but she's gonna give me the put down but, threat, and then I'm gonna miraculously heal. We ended up just doing just traditional. Ozone. When we talked about prolotherapy, you can correct me if I'm wrong prolozone. here, Rebecca. Prolozone. Yeah, prolozone. Prolozone or prolotherapy. It turns out it can be really high inflammatory. It's it's inflammatory. It can it creates an inflammatory response in your body, and so her concern was yeah. that it would create too much inflammation systemically because of what she actually injects into yeah. you. Yeah. Our hope you was know. to avoid steroids. There, um, we're gonna think about it through the weekend. Yeah. Uh, she and our other doctor are okay with it because this is not like a, this is not a chronic, chronic, it's never going to go away kind of issue. It's a lot to go through and it's, it's hard sometimes too to make um, a decision on what to do because there is a level of stress surrounding it all too. I'm walking into the house. A rat. I'm pretty sure that's a rat, not a mouse. Is dismembered. Josiah says that's about the size of the rat that got our sea monsters, hundred sea monsters. Hey, Royal, you deserve a bonus. 
You know how we have 75 acres, but only 10-ish are usable for what we're doing? We got a lot of steep property. We're breaking out the map. Joel Salatin, when he was here, he looked at this with us. You can pan down here. This is our house. We own both sides of the road. And he was looking, and although it's steep right here, you can see the contour lines. There's maybe, he thought, five or six flattish acres up here. So I'm kind of wanting to send the, the boys on an adventure to maybe find this peak. We, are, we, we already found it. Look for any kind of property lines. Did you already find it? Yeah. And then kind of go, kind of go down and then back up. I'm pretty much going to get a survey so we can find our line. And then look, we have these old logging trails. Joel recommended getting our access roads in for future uh, irrigation ponds. So that would be all going down here to our property. And that'd be pretty amazing. You see the old logging trail. Probably won't be that hard to clear. And then, we, wouldn't that be cool guys? We could actually ride around our entire property. And we might really have something here, Rebecca. The top of the mountain right here. That means we could have pigs there. That means we could have pasture. Get a cows. For our animals. That'd be big. We're up here on the top of the mountain looking for a road up to the top of the mountain for Papa. This is the road that the access road will go up. The trail is pretty steep up through here. This is actually really good. This tree fell from up there and it landed straight right in the ground. That's just nuts. Push it. Oh. At Randolph's back today and you guys will never believe, you know, you saw that rat earlier that one of the cats got. But I believe Randolph got her. Look at that. There's my hand. And she had one. She had one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten rat babies, man. So what happened? What's the story, Randolph? Well, I lifted up that floor and uh, she, well, I was going to get the gun and the artillery. She moved every one of them babies to the other side of the room, so I had to take all yeah. of them while it. Yeah, you came and told us about it. Yeah. I was going to do something about the babies. You went back down there. They're 12 feet away. Yeah. Moved every one of them. And you right. saw the mama with them. Yeah. You got her in one shot? No. <laughs> <laughs> I put five I'm in shot. Okay. Sure. <laughs> All right. Shoot her on the run. We got her with a 22. Yeah. That's why we have a 22. And a 22 Magnum because 22 long rifle is good for rats, yeah. little things. Yeah. Yeah. It done good though. Good. It did good. That makes my day. We had a rat eat 100. That rat kill 100 chickens. I mean, it's just looking out for its mom. It, I know. It a, you said it. It's probably pregnant. You said it was either pregnant or had babies, and that's I mean, what it was. You, pre you pregnant mamas get desperate. You do. I gotta say, Randolph gets a bonus. Yeah, I don't know what the bonus is. We could give him a chicken. We could give him some cash money. We gotta give him a bonus. Well, he probably enjoyed that. We got to go hunting for a rat. Did you guys get soaked? Yeah, we ran home from the lake. Oh wow, okay, you came down that side? When we were on that side, it started pouring. Okay, well do we have any, do we have any flat land on our property up there? Yeah. A lot? Mm, I don't know. Let's see what Jonah thinks. What's the report, Josiah? It's flat. It's flat. A lot flat? Pretty much, Mucho yeah. flat? Yeah. Hey, mucho flat or piquito flat? I think so. Can you clear it enough so I can get wheelie up there? I think so. To look. I want you to look in this bin. Oh my gosh, is that a rat? No, that's not a rat. That's the rat. Yeah. But there's a, it is. That's, that's the rat. Do you see what she's got? Babies. You see how babies. many babies? What's that big rat jaw? Right there. That's just an old possum jaw, it looks like. Wow. All kinds of interesting things down in there. Poor babies. Possum, raccoon, who knows? Where'd you find it? Randolph found it under the flooring in the basement. The baby's starting to move. My Went dog. on a rat hunt.